Hello, welcome to my channel. I am Jessica and in this video I'm going to be showing you all of the items that I have from Berliner Bags. I am not sponsored. Uh, this is just a review just to show what I have. Um, all of these products I've owned for a year and seven months. So this very first one right here, this is just the card holder. It is a wallet. It holds uh, four cards on each side and in here um, I just have a hundred just to show that you're able to put some money in there. You can put a card in there. I have two. This one is the cognac color. The other one that I just showed you, it is in the vintage. And um, they are both 100% um, goat leather. All of these products are. And uh, they are all vegetable tanned as well. And I purchased all of it from Amazon. So if you're interested, all of the links will be in the description. And this item is the pencil pouch. As you can see, the zipper is completely metal. It is also goat leather, vegetable tanned, and the lining is 100% cotton. And as you can see, it just has a little patch right there, Berliner bags. And I have two of them. I use it as a wallet. I've used it as a pencil pouch. I've used it as a catch-all little pouch in my purse. Now this item right here, um, it has the zipper pull right there with the bare metal zipper. And on the inside, 100% cotton lining and a little, um, I guess like a little pocket that you can put little things. Uh, this is called the document holder. I usually just put my disinfectant wipes and little things like that that I may need for my children. It has a detachable wristlet. I typically don't have this on there. Sometimes I use it as a purse for going into stores, but I usually just use it in my purse. And I use the wristlet to hold my keys. So, okay, and uh, this one is the backpack. This is in Paris XL. It has a bit of wear and tear. I've uh, poked extra holes in it to keep it closed or a tighter close. It has two pouches in the front and two on the sides. The pouches on the sides are not big enough to hold a water bottle, so water bottles will have to go in the very front instead. And here's the, the back of it, and once again, all products are 100% genuine goat leather, all vegetable tanned. I've used this to take my children to the zoo. I've gone to tourist destinations. I've gone plenty of places with this bag this backpack and it has it is perfect it's easy to use it is um, has padded um, straps for carrying my husband has uh, carried it as well so this is a very unisex it's just a leather backpack so women and men whether you have children or not this would definitely come in handy if you need a backpack and as you can see right here it is a roll top backpack and it just has like the buckle and it is a real buckle it's not a um, one of those false ones it's super spacious inside as you can see there's a little pouch right there with the you can open it it is also metal zipper and here's a little carabiner to keep your keys on just the tag and the lining is also 100% cotton just like the other ones it's very soft really like it um, and once again if you're interested in any of these I'm not sponsored by anyone um, oh and right here so this is a little keychain from Berliner bags that actually came with a backpack and I forgot to show you but once again if you're interested in anything it'll be in the description um, I'm not sponsored okay now this is the purse I use this every single day every single day so this is just a detachable circular pouch that came with the purse and it has a metal zipper lining 100% cotton. You can put headphones in there. You can put um, lip products, coins, cards. So here's just the pouch of Berliner bags. Right here is just the first little compartment. It is um, metal closure, um, magnetic closure I mean. Um, this is just the back. There's a little bit of wear and tear. This is the bottom of it. As you can see, the corners have gotten a little brown. Um, I'm not really sure how to um, clean that off or take that off. Um, but this is the inside. It's cotton lining on the inside. And on the bottom, there is a padding right here. 
um, to hold your thing so it doesn't break the stitching on the bottom of the leather purse. Right here you can, uh, there's a carabiner, there's two parts or two little spaces to put pens or pencils. I do put a little mini um, scissors, comes in handy. This one is for uh, phones. I have an iPhone 11. It does not fit in there, but I put hand sanitizer in there instead. Here is a little pouch. Um, it's zipper line, zipper pull. And right there, that's just the magnetic closure for the purse. It is getting a little loose, but I have used it for over a year and a half. I'm not sure what I'll do when that breaks, but here are the straps. They're very durable. They're very soft. I've had a heavy purse, a lot of things for my children. I've had a very light purse. Um, they don't hurt your shoulders or dig into your shoulders at all. So, and as you can see right there, there's a little black mark also. I think it's just the metal touching the leather. If anyone has any um, advice to clean that off, please let me know in the in the comments. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.